Sorry for the wind, but here's our unboxing. So here's what we got. The bat tier, 40, uh, 48 volt battery system. So they give you the mounting, some cables for Victron and some of the other manufacturers for communication, warranty card, install information, the bar for installing it and nice and thick and all right so we'll start by removing the screws they're all around the perimeter also make sure that this screen's working there's no charge they ship these uncharged so we're good there and uh, we'll get this cover off so here we got the two bat tiers um, these are lithium ion phosphate 51.2 volts 100 amp battery packs so these are wall mounted which i like you have an on switch here Here's your, your model number right over here, sorry. And I wanna remove the screws. I always do this with every unit that I take a look at because we wanna make sure that uh, we aren't having any issues before we get too deep into the project. We have our communication ports. They're all sealed, so it has IP65 ratings, which means it's you know, splash proof. And then the connectors, which are kinda of cool here. Again, you're not just dealing with blank lugs, you are dealing with uh, actual plug-in ports which makes it <clears throat> which makes it easier to put these into parallel so let's go and open her up so it smells like china in here <laughs> most people know who open up batteries what it smells like when you open these up but you have all your cells in here they all still have their qr codes on them which is really nice again you have your model information qc pass sticker we have our bms with a nice uh heat sink on it um, this cable here that hooks into the the front mod the uh, front uh, LCD screen that actually was loose. It came off as soon as I pulled this off. I plugged it back in. But it's always a good idea to open these up and double check that you don't have a problem going on. Also, there's a nice seal around the edge, kind of uh, you know make it splash proof. And then you have a seal, you know your plastic coating here to prevent a shortage. So everything looks good. Um, we have another battery coming in, so we're installing a total of three of these, which will be about 15 kilowatts. And um, stay tuned for the next step in this. I can recommend these batteries because the quality looks good. And so far, you know, with the uh, warranty they have on them, 10 year life and the price, you just can't beat it. So like and subscribe and future videos coming soon.